Buenos dias, buenas noches, buenas tardes, wherever you are around the world. We are here with you today, looking forward to what is going to be a cracking game. And here they are, the boys looking the business. So... There's a nice wide shot of the pitch and what we're looking at. This. 
All looking very, very gorgeous today. Looking f splendid setting. And there's the the boys going through the procedures of and the referee is getting ready. That's looking resplendent. Second versus 13th. Come on, referee, we're ready and waiting for you. Come on, boys, ladies and gentlemen, we need to get underway here. And that we are. Let's make sure you can hear everything and everyone. So, <clears throat> big shout. We will bring you the teams as soon as we got them because we have got the teams, got them nice and early. But uh, I'm sure you're all pretty au fait with these lineup and these lads. Second in the table at the moment, seven points clear, a third, top two go up. That's the main thing. So, we need a nice little run. Angel. Down the line, looking for the Nestor Jimenez, one of last year's celebrated styles. Now, you'll see there in the background, he's doing, is that, um, I think he's doing discus or something. Just in the background there, you see an athlete. Now, we were going to be opposite today and bring you everything to do with this, with the game. We were going to bring that to you. We were going to be over the other side and try and bring you the crowd, but unfortunately... Unfortunately, with the athletics going on, we weren't able to be the other side. But not to worry, we're here with you. That's the main thing. And don't forget, big love from the FCFC family. Give us a shout out. We want to always hear from you, what you're up to, what you're doing. Early doors, Domingo getting through there, looking like it was all going to come together. So... Don't forget, we're here. We want to hear from you, what you're up to, what you're doing. Casa And there's Jacob Thompson. His first touch of the ball today. Bit of a change in the team. You know, the normal team that you see with Williams in the middle, everything else, it's all changed. I know there's some suspension, some injuries. Looking to go quick, there is Jacob Thompson. Vicky in the background, looking resplendent with the camera. Not that Jacob isn't. Kasama, Angel, finding Kendai well. Now, Patrinelli, nice little ball in there, well played, and Jimenez wins the first corner. Pitch looking absolutely splendid tonight. Looks like the carpet. It's always been. So, corner. Kundai. Spin it in. Can we have a, a goal early doors? Cleared by Casamaniar. 
All the way back to Thompson. Yeah, we couldn't set the scaffold up on the running track. Accordingly, when you're sprinting 100 metres and you've got a scaffold in the way, accordingly, that's a problem. All the way back to Nunez. Edison Knight calmly plays it up. Thompson. In the first chat tonight, Wendy saying, how warm is it there, here? Well, it's tracksuit and t-shirt. I'm sure as the sun dips right down, like it did the other night on the uh, La Herradura, a bigger top will be coming out. But it's kind of like, how would we say, suitably warm. It's not hot, but it's definitely warmer than, say, the south of England today. Para goes long, looking for that run over the back. And what a great ball in Domingo. Oh, and cut out there. Brilliant play there. What a cracking ball this was from Para. Great first time cross. Domingo couldn't quite get there. Jacob Thompson overlapping like Alexander Arnold. Right, you fancy this from the edge of the box? Ah, uh, he did, unfortunately. Here's Domingo with the corner, chipped in, and look, this has got goal, but just couldn't get over it. So it's been warmer, but it's nice. Kasama going to be orchestrating everything in there. Para, Thompson out wide, back across the Angel. Angel goes long, looking for Domingo. And that's just too heavy and runs out behind. Domingo, I think it's 11 to his credit this season so far. I have to look back through my notes. Just rustle some paper in front of you. Look. That's me looking through my notes. Brilliant. Well played. Getting in behind. Just Patrinelli just caught a little bit there. Ball in. That's all the way through the Nunez. Angel. Jimenez. Nice one, two there in the middle. And Thompson, but it doesn't quite fall away in the end. Willing Gasama. Casamajor 
on a three-game losing streak. So is hoping we can make it four, couldn't I? We'll play Petronelli, keeping them tight, keeping them back. Chris says, Vamos FCMC, come on boys, let's move up. Hello from Inverness, we are in Inverness. Always want to hear from you wherever you are around the world, because we are a worldwide club, as you all know. So we know we're in Inverness. Wendy came in from Haywards Heath. So that's Scotland, England ticked off the box. I'm sure there's loads watching down in the academy, but let's hear from you. Feminino are watching, I'm assuming, down in Estepona. Let's hear from you. Give us a shout out. Cut out well there by Kundai and Agasama. Oh, nice little play in there. And uh, Maldonado had to be very brave there. And uh, he wins the throw. Jacob Thompson sporting the man bun. Very, very... The man bun's a lot lower back than it was last season from my man bun experience. Now, when it goes further back, does that make it a ponytail? Questions like this just reverberate around the FC Malaga City Academy. Power up now, Gasama trying to make things work back there. William Petronelli keeping it in, stylish. As you see, just taking our time, playing through the motions. Through the phases. Thompson trying to get it working there with Petronelli. Thompson's left with a lot of work to be done. And Kasseba Majer getting very enthusiastic, I think is what we say. We'll play Petronelli. Ah, see, we've got some decisive movement on the ponytail situation. So a ponytail is hanging here. And a bun isn't. So it's in a bun, not hanging. Well, there we go. This is the place to come. Remember, this is a public service announcement as well as commentary. Live here from the jewel of the Costa del Sol, Nerja. Home to Spain's third biggest tourist attraction. The Caves of Nurha, accordingly. And Ellie on the camera tells me they're very good. See a little knock. Just caught there. Oh, yeah. Rolling into each other there. And that's the first sightings of Alberto Cuesta Torres. And he's on the floor. We're underway again. It's Thompson. Para. Nice ball out to Patronelli. Now there's an opportunity for Jimenez. Patronelli. Back to Kundai. Kasama. Again down the line. Good ball there from Jimenez. <laughs> We did this debate the other day. If it's a good ball, but nobody gets on the end of it, is it a good ball? Will Smith, not in Estepona, Richard, but good evening from El Muneca. Excellent to have you on board. Thank you very much, Will. Definitely a ponytail when it's further back. Mm. Yes, but the word's been given, Will, that only if it's hanging. And I don't think there's anything hanging in there. 
We will have a good look a little bit further. We'll try and get a little closer. So we're in Alminaka, just along the road, the spiritual home of FC Malaga City. Good chasing down by Domingo. And coming back from offside position, he couldn't chase it down, but Jimenez can put pressure on it, but it'll go all the way out. Thompson well in. And Parra. It's looking for in there. Torres in the middle to bring it down, but Casa. Bermija. Casa. What do we say? We're going to say Casa Bermija. Casa Bermija. Free kick and the uh, Casa, Casa Bermija players want to make sure the referee knows exactly what happened there. It's very important in case he wasn't aware. So, first chance. Well up, power up. Flick back in and oh, not troubling anybody, but we could have a bit more as it comes across here, look. That's Parra. Nobody on there. Flicked on. And then over. <laughs> Cleared out. Thompson. And Domingo just pushed off the ball there. Line lady, there's Vicky. Capturing all the moments. There she is, look. In action. Catching all the highlights of the game. Back to Nunez. Right, so that's the first third of the first half gone, which is the first sixth of the game. Two thirds of the first half to go. Good ball from Angel. Well, it's a good ball from Angel. Once again, if it's a good ball but nobody's there, then it's not a good ball. If you get a decent cross but nobody's on the end of it, is it a good cross? So, like when the tree falls in the wood and nobody there to hear it, does it really fall? Back to the keeper. Nice run just over the top there, but just a little bit too heavy. Pitch has been warded, so the ball's spinning off it. The Casa Bermija keeper. It's going to go long. Jimenez is trying to put the pressure on the back, but all coming across and nobody's meeting it. And there's Thompson there clearing up at the back. Good defending. Now Domingo, trying to get round the outside. Well played by Maldonado. It's going to be frustrating now. It's going to have, yeah, it's going to have sand on it. So you head it, you're going to get little sandy bits.
Good chase in. Defenders have got to be done. Well, across, well, as well as Angel across there, but that's really well played. By Casabamiha. Get that ball in there. And Parra is there to tidy up. Right, you're going to go short note. And they're deliberating. So it's going to be a right foot out swinger now. Now they've switched. And uh, and bother anybody. Flicked on, but Casabamea got it on there. So it's a Malaga ball. Jonathan Kamas, Vamos FCMC. Great to hear from you, Jonathan. Thank you for being online with us. Don't forget, we always want to hear from you. The lads, watch it back. Oh, that's well cut out by Angel, but it had to be. Otherwise, he was through. Now, Para. Couldn't die. Angel. Outside him, he's got Patronelli. Oh, just staying on side. Well played. Jimenez, nice cross. Coming in at the back post. That pace Maldonado, but he just couldn't quite get there. And... Casabe Miha, clear the lines. I haven't got the numbers in the middle. One on one, though. But they'll go back and they'll build again. And a free kicks as a referee. Well, not quite sure I agree there, but. He's got the ball. Oh. He did it so quickly, the cameraman missed. Right, Casabamiha, chance to launch again. Just coming up to the halfway point of the first half. That means that's the end of the first quarter. Oh, and I, you can't give him that much space in there. Too many people watching. You're not second in the table. Five points behind top with... Oh, handball, sir. Not given. With the game, with the game in hand. Thompson comes, breaks it up, looks for the quick ball for Domingo. Keeper's not coming, but it does roll through to him. Well chased down. Domingo. The ground is really, really wet. It's been given a thorough, thorough soaking. A thorough flash, th thrashing of water. Offside. All right, we go again. And that is exactly halfway through the first half. That is, that is officially the end of the first quarter. Hmm. Not too sure. I mean, six of one, half a dozen the other there, really. That was fine. That was fine, but not according to the referee. And that's all that matters. Don't forget, we all send you big love from the FCMC family and the community of Neha and Almianaka. And we want to hear from you. Give us a shout. Let us know where you are, what you're up to, who you're watching, whether you're watching this thinking, if only I was there in Neha, the jewel of the Costa del Sol. 
It's the place to come and play football, the FC Malaga City Academy. Immerse yourself in football 10 months of the year, UEFA A and Pro licensed coaches. And you get to visit Spain. Guadix at the weekend, what a lovely place, just north of Granada. Set in the hills, amazing backdrop, and you get to see it culturally, it's excellent. Here we got around here, Patrinelli, ball across, oh, and just missed by everybody. Great run down the line from Patrinelli. Torres found him well, one touch. Just flicked over and nobody's there. Just too high for Dominguez. And Maldonado wasn't quite on it on the end. Don't forget the only academy that comes and streams. 198 games so far this season. Your games get streamed, your highlights reel look amazing. And you have the best coaching and facilities in southern Spain. And don't forget you also have teacher. You have classrooms, teachers, education. Well in there, para from distance. Not testing anybody, unfortunately. So this is the 197th stream this season. Impressive numbers. If you come, this is the academy where you get your games filmed and streamed. So all the coaches, they don't have to work too hard to find you. Patrinelli being pulled around, he's got to get back. Well in, Jimenez and cleared. Torres for Casaba Mejia on him. Maldonado, Torres, back to Maldonado, goes down the line. Oh, just run out of space, but good effort. Onto the shot put arena. The freshly laid grass for the shot put this year. Athletics, big in Nurha. Domingo chasing it down. Thompson clears, finds Kundai. Cleared by Mel by Patrinelli. Nothing incisive at the moment. So Casa Ramiha's kit is the reverse of uh, Ajax. Para back to Nunez. Angel. All the way from Las Vegas, USA. Kundai trying to make things happen from the back. Oh, well played, Torres. Nice ball. Maldonado, good quick feet across back post. Oh, and just taking off the head of Jimenez. 
Well played. Maldonado gets round. Great cross here and clear by Casabimi Hart, but the referee says it took a deflection. So it goes out for a Casa goal kick. Free kick for what, though? Didn't think there was anything in that. Oh, yeah, just put had his arm round him, pulled him back. Nobody seemed to be competing there. Now for a goal kick. As they say, one for the purists at the moment, this one. That's the first half hour gone. Two thirds of the first half. And on the half hour mark, can we have an opportunity here? Domingo's got options in the back, back post. Oh, just couldn't get there to Jimenez. It was on though. Good run. Domingo did really well, looked up, saw the opportunity at the back post and just no one there. Couldn't get it across, keeper cut it out. And just lost three on the bounce. Have Casa. Keeping them pinned into the corner. Now a good break. Maldonado got options in front of him. Nearly too heavy on the touch there, but finds Torres. And we go back and we build. Angel. Just no communication in this game at the moment. Leaving it for Patronelli. FC Malaga City's first Friday Night Lights game. Chance to bring you as many of the teams as possible across the weekend. And don't forget, we're off to Valladolid to bring you the academy playing the Liga Club on Monday. 3 p.m. UK time, GMT, the Universal Standard Time.
Remember, 17s and 18s both kick off at the same time. Yeah, I know I didn't plan it, but you've got the situation where we we'll be bringing one of those to you. One's playing on a pitch that can be streamed and the other one's on a pitch that can't be streamed. And well blocked there. Patronelli. You can see this is the height of athletic season. You can see the high jump bed is out. Not quite in the right position, but it's out. All getting ready. But we will be bringing you copies of both games. Don't worry, you're not going to miss out on anything. And Nunes, for some reason, only known to him, punches it from his chest. So instead of us having the ball and building out from the back, we just defend again. Never quite understand the punching. But each their own. Now Domingo. Doesn't make it in. But a, you see the boys in the middle here, look. Right, as it comes out. Right, so he falls over there, takes his own player out. <laughs> I'm surprised he didn't appeal for it. There's a chance. Oh, just got to find feet. Couldn't die. Goes back, Angel. Kasama. Don't forget other trips coming up for the academy. Atletico Madrid, PSG, Barcelona. How good is that? It's the place to be. You want to play top-notch football against top-notch teams, top-notch facilities, top-notch trainers, top-notch streaming, top-notch commentary. FC Malaga said he's where you've got to come. Ten minutes towards the end of the first half. Stay away from all sharp objects at the moment. It will get better, honestly. Maybe a bit of athletics. Maybe you can throw the hammer for us while you're in there. Back we go. Nunes. Also this weekend, don't forget the Feminino. Got the second leg of their area qualifier. They are already 5-0 up from the second leg. Now, nothing is guaranteed in football, but when the Feminino start 5-0 up, that's as close as you're going to get to a guarantee. Nice play, getting down the line. Oh, brilliant cross. Oh, it's in! Goal! Jacob Thompson with the goal. What an absolute corker. Who saw that coming? Nice little one-two here, build. Flick round the corner from Alberto Torres. And look at that. First time shot, beat the keeper, and he will tell you every day of the week that he meant that. Jacob Thompson, the man bun himself. There he is, big smile. In fact, there's no man bun anymore. Doesn't matter, he scored the goal. Calcio Santos says, what a goal, 
One nil on 38 minutes. Woo! You had to wait a very long, drawn out, painful 38 minutes. But that man there, Jacob Thompson, breaks it in the end. Cracking celebrations. The man from Ditchley, Brighton. Shows that he can also do it in southern Spain. So, and the question being asked now on social media, did he mean it? Do you know what? Who cares? 1-0. Cracking stuff from FC Malaga City. That just gives them a 10-point cushion over third. OK, they've still got a game to play, but... Points in the bag, although it is only half time, but we come again now. Now, down the outside, it's Patronelli. He goes for the same. Ah, he hasn't quite got the magic. Out it goes, and it's going to be a corner. Domingo will go across. Now, that is a full on ponytail. So I'm now taking on board what, looking back through my notes, Wendy and Gemma were saying earlier the difference between a ponytail. I know it was Will Smith, wasn't it? A ponytail and a bun. One's got to be hanging. Another cross, Matt. Oh, nobody's there. Conte says, Sue! I think that's good. Locals. Thank you, young man. Angel Ariola will launch this into the box. Looking for power up. He'll meet there, but he comes back. Does he fancy a drive himself? He's got it back. Goes around the outside, gets the deflection. Oh, the keeper picks it up. <laughs> Nothing there, but Gassama just goes to his knees. He'll probably get up quick if the ball comes towards him. Back and Patronelli back to Nunes. That's the man practices his run up in the background of the high jump. Four minutes till half time. Thompson. Maldonado looking for Thompson again. Wins the throw. Is he going to go? No. He's not going to go right back. Looking for options, looking for runners. Some defending to be done here. Boys got their shape again early. Pushing back. Trying to find Domingo through that gap wasn't happening. But Domingo chasing it down all the time. And there's Thompson doing it at the back. Up and down that line. Like a rapper drain pipe. He doesn't stop. Oh, well cut out there, Patronelli. He's got outside him, Jimenez. Oh, that's good defending by Casper Miha. And uh, Patronelli just rolls him to the ground. And there we go. He's saying, I've got a wingspan this big, and the fish I caught was this big. Well cleared, well covered by Parrot. <laughs> so 
So, throw in as the Knight drops in here in Nurha. At the moment, it's a stunning sunset. Flicked on. Thompson clears the lines. Kundai is going to chase it down. I think silly here. Keep him there. Back in. Oh, and that is going to be having nightmares on that one. So as it comes across here, any one of those three might have done better than that. Careful market in the back there. Look at that. Looks like they're advertising the top as they run across the top of the screen. Could be a stream sponsor. We'll have a word. Wilder Rios says something that I might have to translate so I don't say anything wrong. Great to have you on board, Wilder. Couldn't die. Petrinelli coming inside. So that's full time. We're extras now. Down the outside. Well played. Nesta Jimenez. Angel goes short, gets it back. Now he's going to put it in and along the ground. Nobody was picking that up. He'll go again and wins the throw in. He trod on the poor man's foot. And three quicks as the referee. No, nope. he just gives the throw the other way. You know what? He was still 10 yards. And there, ladies and gentlemen, is the half time score. It's finished here at half time. One nil to the Malaga, and it's that man there, Jacob Thompson. And there's Pablo Lejeune saying, well done, matey. Congratulate all the players as they come off. So thank you very much for being with us. First off, we are back in 10. Don't go anywhere because we'll be back. Get yourself a coffee or anything else you want. We will be back with you very soon. Yeah, so, so we're in the UK, uh, my first ever trip over to, to England and um, you know, I think it's been, been a success to be honest. Um, you know, we're finishing up now uh, our, our four day um, experience with a tour around Carroll Road. We brought the boys down here last night, um, they got to see the live Premier League game against Manchester United and then um, we're now getting to see the stadium where um, the Manchester United players and Norwich players were playing last night, so you know, unbelievable experience. Yeah, I think, you know, it's gone as, as well as it could have, you know, we have to review it now and I mean, you can always do 
do better. Um, but for a first hit out, you know, I think we've done um, a sterling effort, and I can't thank the staff enough. You know, from um, from the media guys to, to Juan Carlos, um, Ryan, you know, has been absolute absolute trooper. You know, I think everyone's really dug in, and it shows kind of what this project's about. That is, it's not just the glitz and glamour, but we've got people that uh, are really here for the cause and just to do the best for the players. The best thing probably about the academy is just being able to meet different footballers from around the world and play against the big teams that you wouldn't get to in Australia. The coaches here are absolutely amazing. They help me in everything, uh, teach me the movements, the runs, the passes, what to do and what not to do. And to be honest, I've become such a better player since I've arrived. If I had to describe football in one word, I would choose magical. It's just a sport that I couldn't describe how, how much it means to me and it, everything revolves around it. And it's just all I have, and it's all I'm gonna have, and it's all I want to do for the rest of my life. I would say life, because I feel like my life moves around football, and it's just, I'm always watching football, I'm always playing football, and I just always have it on my mind. Probably a dream, you know. God's given me the ability to play, so I'm enjoying it. Um, I have to keep working hard training, and I'll see where it takes me. I play football because I love it, I just love playing. I love uh, the game, especially Spanish football. Uh, for me, it's like, it's my life. This is my life. I think I have talent, but like I say, it's not enough for all players. Even if you have talent, you have to work, like still training and do everything you can to be at the top level. Basically just, um, if you want to make it, just go for it. Train hard, work hard, and don't give up. Uh, be able to adapt and change to things. Soccer is a very subjective sport, and it's all about the coach's mind and what they're trying to play, but it's really been a fantastic experience for me, and I would recommend you come try it out yourself. Para mí es, es un honor de, de poder estar aquí de, en Balaído. ¿no? Ha sido un estadio que ha hecho muchísimos goles, ha hecho una carrera eh, magnífica. Estaba yo en el Málaga haciendo muchísimos goles. Entonces, ha tenido una propuesta, ha tenido una conversación con Horacio, con todo el directivo. Y para mí fue... Fue emocionante porque tú llegas en un equipo como Celta de Vigo. Para llegar hay un, un camino muy grande. Hay que trabajar mucho, hay que estar todos los días muy concentrado, disciplina táctica, disciplina en todo. Entonces es muy importante tener es lo primero. Y si aquí es lo más importante. Lo que el entrenador está explicando lo que tiene que hacer. Entonces yo lo comento siempre a ellos que hay que aprender. Estamos en no, no una fase de, de aprendizaje muy grande. La formación de ellos es lo más importante de, de, de la academia. La academia, lo, más, lo que más interesa la academia Malaga City, la formación. El objetivo de la academia es formar lo máximo que en el final de año tenemos la certeza que enseñamos a ese chico algo. Eso es lo más importante. Que él esté feliz, 
La felicidade dele é a felicidade da academia. Birds flying high, you know how I feel. Sun in the sky, you know how I feel. Breeze drifting on by, you know how I feel. It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new life. For me, and I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. It's a fantastic day for us, you know, new season, and um, this is a big part we're excited for coming into the the 2021-22 season with COVID now being being past us, it allows for a lot more opportunities for, for players to come back in and, and to work with clubs and get this experience and, and trial days. But to uh, have one of the first trials of the season being with uh, such an illustrious club such as Granada for me is, is fantastic. You know, Silvio has come in. Um, he's been a, a standout player since the day he arrived here. I think his experience in Nottingham Forest has clearly given him some great habits and concepts. It's allowed him to adjust very quickly to, to Spanish football and... Um, He's now maximising that opportunity by training here today with, with Granada CF. Um, I have great confidence in him and I think this is just the start of what can be a fantastic journey for him as a player and hopefully a new academy alumni progressing into the professional game. It was a great experience and a good opportunity. Um, the training session went really well. The quality was very good, the intensity was high and um, the players around me such high quality it makes me raise my game as well so it was very good to me. The coaches um, that train with at Malaga City, um, day in, day out, the training sessions have been very good, the intensity, the quality, and the game has been against some good opposition. It's played me well up to this point, so yeah, it's been very good. Um, I'm certainly well, I'm enjoying it, um, everyone's made me feel welcome. I'm just enjoying my time here, on the pitch, off the pitch, it's been a very good experience, and hopefully I can continue progressing and doing well. Hands of the fine, you know how I feel. Oh, freedom is mine, and I know how I feel. It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new life. It's a new dawn, it's a new day. Obviously, here today, uh, the training ground at Sevilla, um, very, very impressive facilities, and uh, it's a very familiar place to us now. Tell us what it's like to be here for another year um, and what that means to the players out there. Yeah, for me, this is one of the favourite trips on the, on the stop, so to speak, you know, when we, we go around the clubs in the season. And Malo was the first team we ever played, and Sevilla as well in the first season. So, we're lucky now to be able to say that every year since our inauguration in 2013, we've, we've visited this fantastic place. and. Not only as we're growing as an academy as a club, I've got to say as well that the things they're building here and the progressions they're making is for us to learn, to thrive off, and it inspires you to think that if a club of this size keeps thriving for more and looking to do more and be better, you know, that means we've got to do that as an academy as well. 
And obviously, we've come here today, a very exciting squad under the, you know, the reins of uh, Adrian Dominguez. Tell us how things have evolved over the years now, and to be able to compete and really compete with these these teams at the elite level. How does that feel? Yeah, I mean, obviously, we've got the game going on now. We're one one, one nil up, and I think we will dominate. You know, which to say that, you know, most ten years ago would be impossible. You know, we came here and, and probably went left of our. A hat in our hand, so to speak, and um, to, to see the development and really the kind of caliber of coaches that Jan's been since day one, um, a pro licensed coach, uh, a fantastic friend, but also you think in the club the way we're working. Last year he was our senior team coach, won a promotion, um, blood, sweat, and tears, cut and thrust. It was you know a, a really intense season. Now this year he's working with the U18s to bring that kind of experience of someone who's relevant, who's gone and won a promotion in senior football so recently at a semi professional level. And I'll bring that down to younger players. I think it's a fantastic way that we work and we're taking the coaches around and making sure they stay fresh and they also bring new experiences to their players. And for obviously the lucky players out there today, um, tell us what, what you feel they can really take from an experience like this moving forward and how can that help them in their career? Yeah, I think for me it's, it's simple that you know, you're know you now walking into not just Sevilla, which is a Spanish giant, it's a Champions League club. Um, the second you come to the gate, you feel it. It's different than when you go to other clubs. The, from the security, the professionalism, the way they receive you, the facilities they have. But you're playing against players here that hopefully one day we play in the Champions League. Um, you know, For our boys to see what that looks like, see where they stack up against that and see if they can compete, you know, I think for me is that... Welcome back. I thought I'd take this opportunity as the lads are out. So as we get ready, take this opportunity just to uh, bring you the uh, the starting lineup. Let's give you an idea of what was happening. So how do we line up today? Well, as you saw, we started with Jose Antonio Nunes in goal. Ivan Para, Jacob Thompson, that goal scorer after 38 minutes. Francisco Patrinelli, Angel Ariola, Pape Casama. Kundai McViva, Pablo Maldonado, Nesta Jimenez Diaz, Alejandro Domingo, Alberto Cuesta Torres. And on the bench, Alejandro Medina, Kobe Osiwusu, Yusuf Cisse, Samba Ndaye, Osame Quadrigo, Cameron Williams, and Pablo Lejeunez. So that's how we are at the moment. That's how we're starting. And we're about to get underway. The boys are already, and we're about to start. So we're nearly away, and we are. There we go. A lovely, gorgeous setting here in. Nerha. We are back under the way. And Angel Martinez Valverde. Those vamos, campeón Nestor. First corner, second half. Oh, opportunity fell there. We go again. Flicked on. Oh, and so close. Couple of opportunities there. Great play around the outside here. Domingo and just got a flick. And Angel couldn't get over it. And just before that, again, from the corner, it was Angel again. Trying to get the shot away. And everybody desperately clearing. So the night falls here. In uh, And 
Casa Bimiha. They lost three on the trot. This will be the fourth. So they're going to want to do something about it. Ball down now. Side. Oh, just couldn't run through there to the Maldonado. And Casa Bimiha couldn't quite keep it in. So opportunity again for the boys. The sun has fully set now. The lights are just warming up. Thompson, the goal scorer after 38 minutes. <laughs> right, state kept in, they said. Now Para. Angel. Now it has got a bit colder now. The uh, the jumpers have come out. I wouldn't quite say like, you know, fishing thermal jumpers, but it's definitely colder. Para will clear it away. Well, finds Ariola. In for turns fine, Kundai out of the goal scorer Thompson. Gasama Thompson. Gasama. Ball up and over. Casabinia, keep it on. Numbers coming forward here. Some work to be done, but Mr. Ever Reliable Thompson is there. Plays it up the field to Maldonado. And Maldonado battles well, but doesn't win the throw. back. Para, Nunez, very calm and uh, very, very, very tight bum stuff there, but just see. Yeah, that is the uh, and luckily we got away with the goal kick, I think. Para. Kasama. Maldonado. Oh, Para just got caught there. It's Casa Meha. Oh, flipped out nicely there. That's good defending, but he got trodden on at the same time, did Torres. Kasama. We'll leave it to Para. The rock at the back of this defence, the Ashford and Simpson.
Kesama. Now the para. Nunes just playing through the middle, taking their time. Kasama. And tries to find Maldonado there. And it doesn't quite come off. And Thompson clears up. There's Domingo. And you can just see here. And yeah, it kind of just took the man. Says he got the ball. Mm. Kind of did. Went at the expense of the man. Kundai sends him back. Picked over, looking for Domingo, goes to the back post. Now Jimenez, back in the para, stayed up there. Good running with Patronelli. Wins the throw. Casabumi here, I don't agree, but Patronelli. And the referee, he's going to have a word. And the yellow card. Gave a yellow card to the uh, Kasabimiha. Try that again. Kasabimiha coach for being somewhat uh, dissenting. Nice turn there from Jimenez. And he wins the corner. And he's got something to say, but not to worry. Let's get in there. Let's go for it. It's me, Kundai, with the corner. Danger's in there. Click now, Domingo. Can he get it down quick enough? No, he's going to put it back in there, but nobody there with the flick. And that's gone out for another. Right, Domingo will spin this in. And, yeah, handball, says the ref. Yeah, Kasama, always handball. Domingo, oh, nice one, two there. I think it was Patronelli, yeah, and he wasn't out with Tor Torres. Making his thoughts known now. Yeah, caught there. Stopped our flowing movement. So, number 10, when you're, when you're ready, can you just let know when you're ready? And then we'll take the free kick. Thank you very much. Hope you don't mind. Just that is our free kick. Lick on, looking for that quick run of Kundai's. Now Gasama. Oh, nice play there. Maldonado didn't quite run, but we get the ball back. Gasama. Oh, he's missed that. And he's got the overlap down the side. Domingo. Now Maldonado. Oh, nice one, too. Wins the corner. Well played. Good running from Pablo Maldonado. And Kundai is going to come across for the corner. Two hands, he says.
Miss now Kasama. Flicked it on. Oh, not quite troubling anybody that, but well played the boys. That's 10 minutes of the second half gone. And I think that's a substitution, is it? No, nope, new ball needed. And Kasapa Mihart, keeper, gets the ball he requires. Ball down the line. Chasing there for Patrinelli. Well played. There's the overlap. Ball in. Handball. No, says the ref. Yeah, well defended. Did that hit his arm? Well played, Torres. Well, his arm was where his body was, so that's all OK. We'll give him that one. Substitution will be made, just getting his shin pads on. Not that he hasn't had 58 minutes plus half time to get ready. Well cut out by Thompson. Now Domingo, Thompson. Thompson, cut out. Well in Angel. Don't forget. We never want to not hear from you. The big love being get shouting out here from Nurha and the FC Malaga City family. Give us a shout out. Let us know where you are. We know we're in Inverness. We're in Haywood Teeth. We're in Elminaka. Where else are we? Let's hear from you. Always happy to have a chat with you online. It's careful market. Lights up the Nurha sky like a, a sponsor across the screen. Thompson. Oh, nice play, Gasama, but run away. Domingo finds Kundai. Now Gasama again, trying to find their way through from range. Oh, that's disappointing. Our man Torres. We like to be over the ball and get it on target is what we're looking for. Just leant back at the last minute. And skies it. Come on, are we ready? Come on, keep it. Couldn't die, just couldn't keep control of it. Nice play there from the man in check. Some work to be done here by Thompson, he clears.
and offside, but it was a throw in. What can that be? Oh, just pushing the back. Okay, we'll run with that. That little free kick. Thank you. We'll play Maldonado. So that's the first third of the second half completed. So we've just, that's two thirds of the whole game. So a third to go. Kasama, Kundai, all over, oh. just couldn't find his man there, as he spanned, Torres just pulled him round again, yeah, free kick. Chance Casabuha, but Paris there. Paris, such a rock at the back. So solid and reliable. Thompson's got to defend in the do now to get out, stop this cross. Comes in and Kundai away to Kasama, up to Domingo. And now we break. Uh, oh, referee! That will be a yellow card. Absolutely. He just gave him a complete spin. It's like being at the fairground, this one. Look, you know when you're on the saucers and they spin you around? Spin me right round, round like a record. All over, just too heavy. Yeah, it's not going to run that down. It's been a lot of goal kicks. He's been featured a lot. And uh, some substitutions being made in the back. Well, not substitutions being made in the back. Getting ready. It's going to be Cissé coming on. Yusuf Cissé will be coming on. We'll let you know who's coming off as soon as we know ourselves. In the meantime, Kasper Miha are attacking. Is he going to go long to three from Casa? Well played, Domingo. It's Jimenez just couldn't get it rolling, but he's got it now and he's got Domingo. And on the far side, 
He's got the run of Maldonado as well, but he's gone round the outside. He's got two in the middle. Can he get it across? He can. Oh, keeper is just there. And that was a golden opportunity. He's done really well. Beat his man here. And then staying on side. But the keeper was there to clear. So there is the substitution. Cisse is coming on. And leaving the uh, arena is... Everybody's stationary. Nobody knows who's coming off. Still nobody moves. Right, nobody's moving. They're all getting ready for this. The ref's not going to let the substitution go ahead, I don't think. But now they have. And leaving the field is Nesta Jimenez. So there's the substitution. On comes Yusuf Cisse for Mali. Vanessa Jimenez. We're back with it. Thank you, camera. CC will be some injection of pace into the game. Nice big squad, Malagot. Now settled, but big. Juan Carlos and on using it well. Thompson. No, it didn't quite keep it in. So that is, we've just gone over the halfway point of the second half. That means we're into the fourth quarter. Three quarters are played. So substitution. Casa Bermija are going to make some changes. Are they? Are we going to play on? Well... Definitely looks like he's going to be subbed. He's just standing on the side. But in the meantime, this Cissé's first touch. Goes past his players, looking for options. Ah, oh, just trying to find Domingo. Well in. And too heavy, and out it runs. <laughs> so, Mr. Funes will have an opportunity. So, this will be a Casa Bermija will make those changes. Six runners off. And coming on. So linesman is back with us. Para. Thompson. Ball down the line, chasing there. Is a set Dominguez and he wins the throw. Well played. He's always a constant pain up front, always causing a nuisance as we enter into the last 20 minutes. It'll be Thompson with the throw. Cisse turns well and the referee says he was taken out. Yeah, just stepped right across him and took him out. So. It's a 
chance. All the runners are up. Para's there. Put it right in there. Uh, just get flicked on there and not causing anybody any problems. And Patronelli going across to take it. Gingerly onto the running track. Nice break here, Kassa. Just caught it at the end. It's nice play in the middle there. Good teamwork, but broken up. Domingo will chase that down. Free. Bang to the head, they're saying. Nothing in it. <laughs> you didn't even touch your head. I mean, just watch that again. Well, if he's hurt from that much contact, then I'd hate to see him ever be slapped by a wet fish in a fish market. Right, 10. We'll be spinning this in. 15 minutes ago, we've got to stay on top. It's gone direct. Not troubling Nunes. Even though it bounced in front of him. Para. Thompson. Oh, nice play. Brilliant stuff there for Maldonado. Now Torres. Out wide. Cisse, he's got Thompson inside him. He comes in, does he fancy this? Back, that was it, Gassar, Kundai. Oh, nice ball in Domingo, he gets a shot off. Bird offside. And he looks absolutely flabbergasted with that. Really good move from the boys there. Started playing a bit of football as we enter the last 15 minutes. It's the last third of the second half, the last sixth of the game. We're getting there. Chris says, bring it home, guys, 15 minutes to go. Bring it home, he says. <laughs> All down the line, cleared again. Solid at the back there, lads. Casa building, but Cisse and Kundai break it up. Kundai tries to go back to Cisse, goes through his player, play is the ref. And Parra is there. Going for the long one with the flick on near there. Well met by Gasama. 
Does, does he fancy it from there? Oh, well cut out. Well played, Patrinelli. It's come steaming away with the ball. Maldonado. There's an opportunity here, and Cissé's at the back post. There's Domingo. Can he finish? Oh, oh no! Great move, but it just didn't come together. All the way from the back. Great run here from Patrinelli. It's Maldonado going. Looks up. What a great ball into Domingo, but Domingo had stopped, pulled it back, and just. Ah, oh, between them, couldn't get it on at the back post. Does win the corner. It's going to be Kundai, he's going to spin it in. Suddenly a bit of excitement in the game. When you're ready, ref, come on. A uh, quick substitution being made. Casa Bermija, number three, is leaving the pitch. Somebody getting some crump treatment. Another player coming on. Play on, says the ref. Here it is, spinning in. Oh, Para nearly got on the end of it. Back to Nunes. Ariola. Couldn't die. Thompson. Back to Para. Kasama. Couldn't die. Can go again, trying to orchestrate something. Domingo, oh, just too heavy on the touch. Oh, well cut out. Para read that really well. Oh. Petronelli was just taken completely out there. Oh, and the forearm smash. Substitution is going to be made. So coming on, I think that's... Uh, leaving the pitch, I can tell you, is Torres... And coming on, I, th I think that's Samba. Wait for the turn round just to confirm. Yep, it is Samba. And Daye is on for Torres. Just strengthen up that midfield, hold things down. Inside the last nine minutes now. Now that Keane. Nice ball in behind. And goal kicks as a referee. Domingo. Yeah, that definitely gets the ball. Uh, 
her man. In black and yellow again. Thompson. Ooh. And that, 21, has been told to behave himself, but woo! Oh! 21 just took the ball and then, then makes the shape of a ball when he left. That's probably the size of the bruise on his ankle. How was that not a booking? Seven minutes left. Oh. <laughs> what a cracking forward roll there. From Ivan. Who would have thought? Thompson, here we go. Pushing the back and oh B A G A bit gymnastics award four. Just slowly pulling Kassa out, trying to run the clock down. And cool, gets so tight there, does Nunes. And doesn't find his man either. Well in there, Kasama. Thompson. Back to Para. We'll happily go back to Nunes. It'd be nice if he got it rid of it just before the players get to him. Up to Domingo. Nice ball over. Samba was running through, but not offside. Play on, says the ref. Got to keep this pressure up on the ball. That's a good running back. Lads are really de defending as a team from the front. Approach the last five minutes. Chasing it down. Kassa looking dangerous, and they've got players left over there. Some defending to be done. Cissé well in. A little bit of claim for handball. What's really thinking that? The claim to handball. Didn't look very clear if it was or not, but the ref said no. Coming up the last four minutes now. Come on, lads, hang on. Gone long. Oh, back post. Nobody was there. And that was interesting. <laughs> Seven turned, ran into a man. And claims he was shot at dawn. Right, another substitution. Now we know who that is. That is the one and only Cameron Williams. And coming off looks like it's gonna be Kundai. Cameron Williams. Give it the last six or seven minutes. Normally a regular starter. It's all about mixing this squad up, making sure everybody gets good time on the pitch. 
Make sure you last eight games. Be nice to win all eight, but the requirement is to win at least six. So this is one down. Five wins to go. Cameron Williams, a regular in the Café de Inez with his brother. Obviously likes a nice cup of tea. Free kick given away by Maldonado. Has a Bermija chance to come forward. Everybody flooding forward. And ever reliable power at the back there. And CC tries to bring it away, but. And now Samba's there as well. Now Williams picks it up. Nice little ball up the line of Cissé. And yeah, just couldn't get on the end of it. And now it goes. Well, in Domingo, just keeping him up that end. Casa really pushing for this equaliser. This is four on the bounce they've lost. Into the last 90 seconds of regular time. Well met on the edge of the box. Oh, well played. Kasama, he's got CC on the outside if you can find him. Oh, and he's just taken out. And that's another card for another player. Good run. Great play here by Gasama and six. That's just a body check. A complete body check. I would have said that he's at least eight yards from the ball when he hit there. Absolutely ridiculous. And the physio's allowed to come on now. So this means that we're going to run out into the 90 minutes and have a few more added on. Ivan Parra's there. Making sure he gets treatment. And it's a bit of cramp. And the Casa Bermija players are saying, really, come on. Well, you shouldn't have body checked him. All having a go here. <laughs> Every player's a doctor. So, we're set. We just require the rest of the players to get back now. Kasama has miraculously survived. It's got to be a good five minutes of extras. How far out are we? Mm, possibly a top bins. What's he fancy here? Samba, Kasama, oh. Not really troubling the keeper, really. So we have a ball. It's got a good, it's got to be a good four minutes. Kasama was down there for a couple. Oh, 
Back in. A well played Williams. And uh, he's just like, again, just taken out. There's a certain method. If you get in front with the ball there, well done. And now, oh, another body check. Another WWE moment. So surely just all the way to the keeper, unfortunately. It was a bit of a waste. So that's three minutes of extras, but I reckon it's got to be another couple because Kasama spent all that time on the floor. But we break again, Williams. And he's taken out. See here, Kasama, up to Williams, turns as he gives the ball away. He just caught his ankle. So everybody gathers around again, and we can add another two minutes to the game. <laughs> Para is such a, a, a calming influence on everybody. Tell everybody what's happening, what's going to go on. Kasama fancies this, does he? How far out are we? Incredibly far. It's just got to be chip over. Try to find CC. Now Williams. Back to Thompson. Nice ball down the line. Casemiro cut that out well. Take two players out, three players out at the same time. Some defending to be done here. Well in Gasama. Well in Williams. Picks it up now Domingo. Can he break it? He go first time to CC. He can't. And Dai doesn't quite get there. And there's an offside there. Didn't look anywhere near offside, but so that's five minutes gone. Nunes will take it. And Cissé couldn't keep that in, so Kassab beat Bimiha. Surely they're going to go now for one last attempt. So it's four on the bounce for them. With that, he got the ball, didn't he? Oh, maybe he missed everything actually. But no card. So now we're into the sixth minute. Well, we've had six, we're into the seventh. So the last opportunity for Casabimaha. Oh, it's fallen from there. Nobody's getting on the end of it. Let's clear it. Oh, that's well cleared. Cissé clears it up the line. Domingo, the keeper has to deal with it. He can't. Defending to be done. Williams, oh, and that's well played in the end by Casaba Miha. Keeper did really well there, and they're going to go again. Got a man in the middle. And oh, 
And ladies and gentlemen, at last, we do have the end of the game. And it's ended there. 1-0 to FC Malaga City, courtesy of Jacob Thompson after 38 minutes. Well played. There is the goal score in the middle of the pitch. Picture, photo, middle of the screen. That's probably what I was looking for. Great victory in the end. Well played, boys. We kind of got there. Let's just say you've probably done more exciting things on a Friday night. So let's just have a look at that goal. Thompson starts there. Nice little one-two round the corner with Torres. Goes all the way back. And I think that's a shot. I know. Yes. Let's look at here. It was a nice little one-two here. Oh, brilliant stuff. So, well played. That's it. All ended here. Big shout out to the crowd. Well played, the boys. So, don't forget, we're joining you tomorrow. Not not tomorrow, sorry. It's um, Sunday. And then we're also bringing you the uh, Valadeloid. But follow the social media, because they probably know a lot more than I do. As I blather away there, trying to remember what's happening where. So thank you very much. We know we're in Inverness. We know in Awood Teeth. We know in Elminecker. We were probably lots of other places around the world, but you were too shy today. But don't let that hold you back in future. So thank you very much for joining us. And we will be back with you as soon as.